Hi Aquarius, I hope that everybody's doing well. Before we get into this, I would like to set the intention for this to be a space where everyone allows themselves to feel seen and validated and ultimately for this to be a safe space and a healing space in alignment with everyone's highest good. All right, Aquarius, let's see what's going on for the energy of December. I'm seeing something going on in an interpersonal relationship, okay? Maybe an energy that we're moving into. Maybe something coming to light as well about um, an interpersonal relationship that we're involved in. I'm hearing something about a truth space. There may be an upcoming decision that needs to be made. Something that we may not have all the information about at this point okay but whatever it is i'm seeing that we're going to triumph with whatever decision this is something that we go back and forth with maybe trying to figure out whether or not we want to be involved with somebody okay i'm hearing something about partnering up It's almost like I don't know if I want to do it. I don't know if I don't want to do it. Maybe also weighing um, weighing how stressful or um, easy this is going to be. I'm seeing that whatever dynamic this is, it may be... Um, I'm hearing something about stress relief, okay? Maybe by partnering up with this person, it's going to help relieve a sense of stress. I'm seeing a balancing out that happens. I'm hearing new perspective. This is in regard to um, whatever this thing is that we're going back and forth on. I'm seeing um, I'm seeing a pretty dynamic shift that goes on with this, okay? And I'm seeing us also taking on maybe um, somewhat of a mentoring role. This can be also finding um, finding a mentor as well, if we're not the one being the mentor. I'm looking at us coming to a realization about something, okay? I'm looking at the... Um, the Emperor over here and Pisces. I'm also looking at Libra, Gemini, and Scorpio. There may be a situation too where we're being called on to um, to judge this thing for ourselves. Um, I'm hearing something about a justification, okay? I'm seeing that setting forth truth and whatever this is is going to help us um, release something that we're carrying, okay? And I'm seeing that also a dynamic that we're entering may, um, may help us out with a discipline that we're practicing, okay? And I'm seeing too that we're going to be moving into a place where we're going to find a sense of um, a sense of balance in a relationship that we've been looking to see, okay? It's like moving into a place where we're feeling an established sense of balance, I'm getting. Maybe after there had been um, a sort of tension, chaos, something like that.
I'm seeing that in um, in looking to establish this sense of balance um, because of a chaos, a sense of chaos, a sort of chaos that had manifested. The chaos was why we had been going back and forth, but I'm seeing like a big change that happens with this, okay? I'm also getting somewhat of a power struggle. Okay. I'm seeing that um, we come to the realization about somebody in our physical environment, somebody that may be at a frequency that's out of balance with ours, maybe recognizing that we don't want to be working with somebody anymore because of... Um, because of their frequency, okay? I'm getting something really out of balance, okay? Maybe something with the sexual energy. But I'm seeing us working to establish a sense of balance, I'm hearing, regardless of this frequency. I was looking at um, Capricorn Pisces popping out. I'm hearing planning for the future. I'm seeing a goal that we have in mind and us choosing to, I'm hearing, take up an opportunity. And I'm seeing that we are being guided to move into a place where we're ready to speak out about something. I'm hearing reunion. I'm also seeing like a celebration energy because of completing a goal that we've been looking to manifest, okay? And I'm seeing us moving to a place as well where we are resolving something in the heart space. We also may be moving away from somebody whose energy I'm hearing is in disagreement with ours. I'm getting that this is the decision. Um, this is in relation to a decision that we need to make. Maybe something comes to light and we realize that um, there's something that we need to do, an action that we need to take with somebody in order to manifest something that we want to see, okay? I'm getting that we understand that it's time, I'm hearing it has come time for us to move out of a space. Maybe we have been um, caught up in a cycle, a storyline where somebody that we had, um, I'm hearing, been manifesting with. Maybe their character comes to light in a way where we feel like it's no longer resonating with us. I'm looking at what's hidden on the bottom of the deck. And I'm also looking at a karmic test popping up. I'm hearing full proof. I'm seeing us deciding to release something, okay? Assessing a situation and realizing that it's time to let go. Something that we've been holding on to maybe a little bit too tightly. I'm seeing us setting boundaries as well. Maybe communicating an ending with somebody. Maybe the fact that we're ready to move on from something that we had been involved in. I'm hearing cyclical. I hope that everybody's doing well, Aquarius. Yeah, I'm seeing that there may have been a situation going on where... Um, we felt that it was not um, it was not something harmonious, okay? And I'm seeing spirit guiding us away from this. Because I'm getting that it was manifesting um, some anxiety, maybe us losing sleep. Maybe worry. I'm also getting that strongly. Worry. And we're being guided to set boundaries to protect the heart space, okay? I'm getting protect the energy as well. I'm hearing as guided. I'm hearing something about a retrieval. I'm looking at us going into a direction that we feel I'm hearing passionately led by. Maybe doing something that um, I'm hearing that we've had a fondness of since childhood, okay? Maybe us reviewing things from the past as well. I'm seeing that we may be doing something... Addressing something. 
maybe from the past even. We may be guided to um, step into a soul contract with somebody, okay? I'm getting a reunion vibe. I'm seeing also that there may be something that we're pulling back from intuitively. We feel that um, we need to take a break before we start something else. Maybe reorient ourselves and um, kind of understand what is going to make us happy and also what we don't want to be participating in as well, okay? I'm seeing that in order to maintain a sense of happiness, maybe even build towards that, we're being guided to not participate in something, something that feels hurtful to us, okay? Maybe this has to do with like some sort of, um, I'm hearing some sense of negotiation, okay? I'm seeing us really being guided to start something new rather than focusing on um, something from the past, okay? It's like maybe there's something that we need to review in order to move forward. And I'm seeing us getting ready to start a new beginning. I'm hearing new venture. And I'm seeing something about an activation with a soul contract, okay? I'm hearing manifesting past that point. I'm also getting too that um, we may be taking an offer that we feel like we're being guided into by spirit, okay? This may have to do with a job. <clears throat> we may be leaving an old job behind. I'm also hearing relationship for some of us, Aquarius, okay? It's like this ending needed to manifest in order for us to um, clear the heart space and find a true union. I'm hearing the word symbiosis. Symbiosis is a word that came through originally in um, one of my Pisces readings. So I'm looking at Pisces falling out now and I'm seeing that. Um, so symbiosis is a mutually beneficial relationship between two organisms, okay, in a close proximity with each other. And I'm seeing that um, there may have been something before that we felt hurt by and we are being guided not to take any offers to renegotiate this, okay? I'm getting like a space where we're moving out of that and into maybe a new storyline for ourselves, okay? And maybe realizing a new direction that we're being guided into, okay? I'm also getting that we're being guided to be patient with something new that we want to start. And I'm seeing that once we complete this lesson, there is an opportunity that's going to manifest for us. I'm hearing heading in our direction. But first we need to release something that's ending, okay? This is like starting a completely new storyline that we're being guided into. And we have to get out of our heads with something. I'm getting like getting out of our own way. Maybe even calling out an ending. Maybe communicating that we're ready to release something. And I'm seeing us moving into a brand new space. We're also being guided to... Um, to look within as well because there may be a sense of confusion that we're feeling regarding whatever ending this is i'm getting like breaking ties with something okay and we're being guided to look within in order to resolve this okay especially with not renegotiating an offer to participate in something again that we felt hurt by and i'm seeing a new opportunity that comes through i'm hearing something that's going to resonate okay Something that we're going to feel like is in alignment for us. And we realize this as we walk away. Again, I'm getting as we cut ties with something that was no longer resonating. It's like we were no longer finding happiness in whatever space that is. And that's the sign that we needed to move away into a new dynamic, okay? 
I'm hearing working, start working, beginning. I'm seeing something manifest with um, a new relationship, a new collaboration. I'm hearing interpersonal. And I'm seeing that because we chose to walk away, we're going to be now walking into a sense of, um, I'm hearing prosperity. We may feel conflicted also about not renegotiating whatever offer this is that comes in for us, but I'm getting that when we get in touch with the heart space, we know exactly where we're being guided, where we're being led. I'm hearing karmic resolve. I'm seeing us being guided to set boundaries with someone, okay? Protect the home space. Maybe protect our energetic field as well. And to also be making sure that we're taking care of ourselves. I'm here and keeping up with that. There may also be somebody that we're being guided away from because of the stress that they bring to us. I'm hearing into our lives, into our auric field. It's something that um, that feels out of balance, okay? That's how you'll know what that is. I'm seeing a sense of stability that we gain. Um, I'm hearing through a mutual attraction. It's like maybe somebody that is emotionally in a similar place to us, Aquarius, that we're linking up with. After ending something that we needed to end. If we're facing an ending too, we're being guided to um, we're being guided to do this in a tactful way. I'm getting okay. So in this next cycle, I'm getting storyline. We're going to find what we're looking for, okay? Because I'm seeing us having um, having our eyes on what's going to um, feel reciprocal in a relationship, okay? I'm hearing something about evening out. We also may be in our heads about starting something new, too, I'm getting. Okay, so I'm seeing us being guided to step out of something, to end something, to break ties with a union. I'm hearing, um, I'm hearing former, so maybe a union that we had in the past, because I'm seeing that um, we weren't, um, we weren't finding what we were looking for in this thing. Maybe there was a lack of, uh, a lack of balance, feeling stressed out. I'm getting because of somebody's behavior. This is why we're being guided to move away from that. This can always be us with ourselves. Yeah, I'm seeing somebody that, um, somebody that we were working with, somebody we were interacting with, um, things not going, I'm hearing, according to plan, okay? It's like we may have felt hurt by this relationship, by this dynamic. That's why cutting ties is necessary. I'm hearing two hour growth. And it's going to help further us along to finding something that does resonate with us, okay, Aquarius? And I'm seeing a transformation regarding the stress that we've been feeling. Maybe dropping that sense of stress by moving away. I'm hearing from this character, from this energy, and healing it. It's like you don't have to carry all of that stuff anymore. I'm seeing us having a really big release. And I'm seeing us maybe pulling back from an energy that we feel overwhelmed by. I'm hearing somebody's, um, somebody's behavior, okay? And into a new beginning. I'm hearing smooth sailing. This is something that we wish for, something that we hope for. It's like starting something brand new after ending whatever cycle this is that was just not working anymore.
I'm seeing us making progress with um with maybe going I'm getting in a new direction okay I'm seeing us making progress it's like you get into a place where you're feeling more in touch with um with your passions maybe something that you want to pursue and I'm seeing us making progress with something new that we've started okay it's like there may be um there may be abilities that you have that are coming to light that now you can I'm hearing press forward on something that you're being guided to do something you feel spiritually guided to do okay this is a project that feels in alignment with what you're meant to be doing and I'm seeing us getting ready I'm hearing for an announcement We may also be communicating with others that we're ready to take a step in the direction of what we feel like we're passionate about, okay? I'm hearing passion project. And I'm seeing that somebody may be coming in and communicating, um, communicating with us. Maybe an offer that they have in mind, okay? I'm seeing us um, being guided to be grounded and bring, um, I'm hearing truth and authenticity into this connection. I'm seeing us also being guided to be mindful of, um, I'm hearing the things that make us feel defensive, okay? This is like checking our shadow, because I'm looking at... <clears throat> Okay, I'm hearing somebody from the past planning a return. Us being guided not to take this offer, okay? This is somebody that we feel connected with. I'm hearing on a deep level. I'm getting that the plan, though, is not to take whatever this offer is, again, to renegotiate. But I'm getting that this person is watching you. There may be an interpersonal conflict that comes to light, and I'm seeing that at the end of it, we're going to, um, I'm hearing move past this, okay? And this is part of a lesson for us to move into a place where we're calling things out and advocating for ourselves too. I'm hearing our energy. I'm looking at us starting, um, starting a new path, starting a new direction. I'm looking at the lovers here and I'm looking at that falling over spirit. I'm getting that there's going to be a sense of clarity and communication that comes through. Something that um, we may not be expecting, I'm getting, okay? Something that we also may not be seeing yet at this point. Something that has to do with an interpersonal relationship. I'm getting to that there may be um, there may be a lesson that we're in the midst of learning that's going to give us clarity with how we want to proceed in our physical environment with something, okay? We may be recognizing too that something was out of balance before and that's why we were being guided to move away from it in order to um, regain a sense of balance. I'm seeing us being guided to communicate clearly and set boundaries in an interpersonal relationship i'm hearing close interpersonal relationship i'm hearing pisces really strongly here this is somebody that we feel i'm hearing a mutual connection with i'm also hearing soul bond i'm hearing soul tie this can be that area of your chart this can be that area of someone else's chart When it comes to um when it comes to matters of interpersonal relationships, um looking at your Venus sign will be helpful to you. That's just coming up maybe for anybody curious. My Venus is in Pisces. Lots of love there. I'm hearing moving into a direction that's goal oriented.
I'm hearing here's the deal. We may be emotionally carrying a lot, okay? I'm hearing boundaries are going to be important. We may be moving into a place as well where we're um, dropping some of our defenses and getting more in touch with our intuitive nature. I'm hearing emotional as well. I'm also hearing emotional standpoint. Maybe feeling a bit of stress, maybe because of a sense of responsibility that we feel I'm hearing is weighing on us. Okay. This is so funny. I'm looking at Venus and I'm looking at Pisces popping out here. I'm hearing calling our energy back to ourselves. It's almost like you may feel um you may feel a sense of weight on your shoulders for something that you feel you're being guided to carry out, okay? But it's like when you look within, you realize that you're the only one that can complete this job. I'm hearing job tasks that need to be done, okay? And I'm seeing that stepping into our power sometimes can be overwhelming when we feel like there's a lot of responsibility weighing on us and i'm seeing us really being guided to um i'm hearing a look at the benefits of this of stepping into our power of being on a path that we feel guided i'm hearing to walk upon i'm hearing venture upon I'm getting too that this whole process of stepping into our power was one um, one that we may have felt resistant to at a point and one also that has taken a lot of work to get to. I'm hearing to the point of enlightenment, Aquarius, like a lot of lessons that we needed to learn, maybe to step into a place where we felt we could be effective in what we wanted to accomplish. I'm getting too that there may have been a sense of inner conflict that we were feeling too um, as far as our interpersonal relationships. That noise is Octavia for anyone hearing that. We could have also had some sort of conflict. Um, I'm hearing with co-workers, something at work, not for everybody, just for some, okay? And I'm getting that this could be part of the reason why we're being guided to move in a new direction. Maybe we just didn't feel like something was in alignment anymore for us and for what we wanted to be doing and it was time to move on because I'm getting that in starting whatever new project this is that we feel our eyes have been open to now, I'm hearing, okay? We're going to find um, a sense of balance in that, okay? Like it's something that we're meant to be doing. And I'm seeing us working hard to transcend whatever disappointment this was because things in the past hadn't worked out in a way that we wanted them to. And also us moving to a place where we're realizing that we can be effective in manifesting the things that we want and that we have all of the tools I'm hearing and capabilities needed. I'm hearing to manifest this. I'm hearing into our physical reality. I'm seeing too that there's going to be a change that we feel maybe with things that we had been carrying. We could have been stressed out because there were um, there were struggles that we were going through, maybe in interpersonal um, relationships. And I'm seeing that there's a really big change that comes through for us in stepping into a place where we feel confident to be doing things on our own. And I'm seeing us... Um, I'm seeing us getting in line with um, with resolving a sort of tension between the yin and the yang energy, okay? This can be with um, within, this can also be in a relationship outside of yourself. And you may also realize too, 
that there's something I'm hearing that needs to be confronted if it has not been already in regard to um, in regard to a job that we had, okay? This can also be with a father figure. This can be with somebody funding something, okay? I'm getting for some, this can be a motherly figure as well. Yeah. If there's somebody in our physical environment that we feel like is not being upfront and honest with us, we're being guided to set boundaries. I'm hearing um, barrier barricade with this person, okay? Something that we need to call out. I'm hearing something we need to be upfront about. Maybe also about us understanding that we're being called in a new direction and we're being guided to advocate for ourselves. I'm hearing lesson underway. I'm getting that once we start this new cycle, there's reciprocity that we're going to find in doing what we feel like we're being guided to do. I'm hearing soul mission, soul path. And I'm seeing that... Um, there is something I'm hearing looming in the auric field for some of us that really needs to come to an end in order for us to start this new beginning. I'm hearing storyline again. Storyline keeps coming through. And for us to end things in a balanced way where we feel um, where we feel good about um, about the way that we end things, okay? I'm hearing the word resolve. And I'm seeing us too gaining a clear idea in the direction that we want to go in. What we want to be focusing on. And I'm getting also that we're being guided to, um, to really act with a sense of balance, okay? I'm hearing in this transition, I'm hearing new space. It's like we're moving into a direction that we want to be moving into, okay? And I'm seeing harmony that's happening. This can also be something going on um, internally too, where there's something that we need to confront in order to move forward, okay? I'm hearing being comfortable calling it out. But I'm seeing us transitioning into a place where we're finding a sense of harmony that we've been looking for. And now I'm looking at um, I'm looking at the Hierophant and I'm looking at the Devil popping out together. In order to start something new, in order to start something new that we're looking to start, I'm seeing us really needing to um, be mindful of what's holding us back. I'm hearing elemental. What's holding us back in a way where we may be focusing on things that are physical, things that are 3D, things that we feel fearful of, and we're really being guided to go in the direction that we feel our spirits are pulling us towards, regardless of... Um, Regardless of fears that we may be feeling, again, anything holding us back, anything that seems out of balance to us, and be ascending things in our physical environment, I'm hearing transcending in order to get into the place where we're trying to go, where we feel like we're being moved, okay? This is also um, potentially bringing... Um, bringing more of a sense of spirituality into our environment, okay? Maybe focusing on a sense of spiritual practices. I'm hearing something we're learning about. And I'm getting that um, we may be working closely with our guides. I'm hearing guidance on this one. I'm hearing falling into place. 